This exercise asked you to find GIS data relevant for your municipality and it asked you to find seven specific data layers having to do with hydrology and stormwater. I'm not going to uh, show you how to get every single one, but I'm going to show you how to get a few so that you know the, the process of getting the data and uh, viewing it in ArcGIS. Uh, the first one that I'm going to show you is the Stormwater 167 and I'm simply going to just do a keyword search on Stormwater and hit submit. And we notice that that data layer is down here at the bottom so I simply click on it and then click download and then it will begin to download. As that's downloading, I'm going to go back um, and uh, get some other data that was requested. Um, another uh, other data sets that were asked for are, are county boundaries, municipality boundaries, and school district boundaries. To get those, you simply have to go to boundaries and you're going to find all of those uh, in here and luckily enough um, the other one that you'll find in here uh, is number one the Pennsylvania small watersheds so um, you can get uh, four of the um, data sets just from uh, this area here um, for streams I'm just gonna do a keyword search on that because there's a lot of stream data um, and it just makes it easier to do the, the keyword search and we're looking for network streams and again there looks like there's a ton of stuff here so it, it can be very easy to miss uh, here are the network streams at Pennsylvania and again you just click that to uh, download it and it'll download it just like the stormwater one did there and then um, the uh, National Wetlands Inventory for Pennsylvania. Uh, I'm going to take a, a gander and, and um, I think it would likely be under hydrology. So I'm going to click that and scroll to see if that is indeed under hydrology. And uh, it is, so just click this to download that data. So that shows you where it all is. Um, I'm now going to just use the Stormwater 167 as the example of how to extract and then how to add to ArcMap. You would follow the same procedure for um, all other uh, data layers. Um, and this can be done, um, you know, any way that is um a couple different ways so there's no one completely correct way of, of doing this I'm going to go to show in folder because it'll show it up in my uh, download uh, folder and then I'm just gonna actually cut it and uh, paste it in an, an area that I want it to, uh, to be and I'm just gonna put it um, in my documents for, uh, for right now and I'm gonna paste it and then I'm going to extract that um, and then it will extract the shapefile in, uh, to my documents folder. Now that it's extracted, I can open up ArcGIS and then simply click my Add Data button and then navigate to the folder in which it is located. So I'm going to go to my C drive to um, Users. And we can see right here is my Stormwater 167. I can double click it to add or just single click it and hit add. And voila, there are our um, watersheds for the state of Pennsylvania. Later, you will learn how to clip um, this data layer just to get the watersheds within your municipality.